Hello everyone, it is Friday the 6th of December at about 2.30pm and I've just handed in my last essay. I have no more finals until the 16th and it is finally time to begin the sewing machine project. So this thing, no word of a lie, probably weighs at least 50 pounds and it is absolutely gorgeous. I found this at village for 30 bucks when I was looking for a kettle and immediately put down the kettle and pick this guy up. This is my beautiful machine. It is a beacon from I don't even know what year and it is just stunning. I absolutely love all of the work that's been put into the little flowers here on the edge. It is in perfect working condition. I tested it out at the store. The beautiful silver on the side here. Just stunning. Absolutely love the machine. Obviously the case is completely falling apart. But that is what I'm here to do today. My first step is going to be to rip all of this paper off of the case. Underneath there's some really nice wood once it's going to be all sanded up. And I'm going to completely refurbish the case and then give the machine a nice clean, get everything set to go. It has been three hours, and I'm finally done scraping off all of the paper from the box. This is my huge scrap pile, which has an absurd amount of nails in it as well. And here are the two boxes. They have yet to be sanded, but that is my next task. This can take a lot longer than expected. Day two, take two. I tried to sand the thing by hand last night, and it was definitely not effective. So I'm going to Home Depot now, picking up an electric sander, uh, and then getting back to work. Good morning! We are on day four of the sewing machine verb, and uh, the stain has been drying for the past like day and a half. I did it uh, on Saturday. And now I'm off to pick up a leather belt that I found on Used Victoria that I'm going to be cutting and then uh, riveting to the top as the new handle, because as you can see I totally ripped off the other handle. I, I thought I could save it, but it's it was just too far. And then I'm going to go to Home Depot and grab a little can of, of um, a gloss finish that I can put over top of the new stain. What else? I'm going to go to a fabric store and try to get some fabric for the inner lining of both where the machine is sitting and on the top part of the, of the container. Okay, we just came from the sewing store. I just came from the sewing store. Uh, I got some leather, some like leather lacing that I'm going to use to put between uh, the little ridges on the outside of the case. I was going to stick with gold, like a gold fleckle kind of uh, rope, but I feel like this might look a lot classier. So I got that, and I also picked up some just plain black fabric for the inside lining and also the bottom little compartment um, for the sections that'll be exposed.
Okay, we are all done the stain on the outside. I have put in a little piece of um, like support backing. It's going to help with putting in the handle. I'm going to put the screw right into it. Screw the handle on, put the little caps on, uh, and then start working on the inner lining fabric, and then we're so close. It's time to make the inner lining. I have the material here. I'm gonna give it a quick wash, uh, put it in the dryer for a second, and then make a pattern just from using the inside of this, measuring a little bit, and then probably sew the edges just to make it look more nice, but we'll see how much time I have. So I instinctively went to grab my other sewing machine to sew all the little pieces together and I thought, hey, I might as well use the new one because it's already working, so I'm going to go set it up and give it its first sewing job. Okay, I got it. I'm going to go attach this thing into the box. So the cover that I just sewed doesn't want to stick to the inside of the box. I tried nailing it, I tried gluing it, I tried taping it. It does not want to adhere, which is really fun. Which sucks, because that was like three hours of cutting and sewing. But I want it to look good, so I'm going to do it the right way. I'm going to go probably grab some maybe like poster paper tomorrow or something and try that. We're back. It is day, I don't know, six, seven now? Uh, yesterday was a complete fail. The fabric that I was using for the inner lining is most definitely not going to work. Um, I was really sad because I thought, you know, using the, the machine's first sewing project would have been really cool. So instead I decided to go back to what the case originally had on the inside, which was just paper. And I bought some black poster paper and I'm just going to basically glue the poster paper back into the inside. It's gonna look a lot better than what was originally in it, um, but we'll see how it goes. I think it's gonna look pretty good. This proved to be much more difficult than I could manage, so I think this will be a success. And if it is, today will be my last day because my polishing cloth arrived and the feet that I'm screwing into the bottom also arrived. So now that we have all that set, I think today is gonna be the final day, which is sad but awesome because this has taken a lot longer than I thought it would.
so that's it. We're all done. She's all cleaned up and the case is looking good and I'm really happy with how everything turned out. If I were to do it again, I would definitely know what shortcuts to take and what steps to avoid, but overall it was really fun. I have to go to rehearsal right now, so that's it for today. Thanks everyone for watching. This is fun.